So hi everyone, this is Linda and welcome to my channel. Today guys, I have been really collecting the last, oh my goodness, I want to say two months worth of art supplies to show you guys. So I'm going to get started because this is going to be a long one. I bought things that I um, haven't tried been wanting to try and um, it's a lot of stuff so I'm going to get started so first thing I want to share is I bought these water soluble sketching pencils these are um, from Derwent and they come in this cute little tin and that's what they look like and it comes with a sharpener and I like that they're different uh, gradients and um, they're gonna be fun to play with so and I like the water soluble graphite so there is that okay so we're gonna one all right so the next thing is I got this set of mechanical drawing pencils if I can find the links for everything, I will leave them below. And when I haven't looked hard at anything because when it came in, I just set it aside until I got everything. Um, let me if I get this open. It's in this nice little case, and I don't know if it's taped. Feels like it might be taped. Oh my goodness, it is. No, it's not taped. It's just another click. Hold on a second, guys. Hmm. Well. Okay. Oh, there. It was easy. Alright, so here is the set of... I love drawing with mechanical pencils. Like, especially sketching out my work for um, watercolor. And... These are really, really nice. They're going to be nice. And they're different um, sizes. So, um, and it comes with refills. It's a nice little set. So, this is 2.0, 2.0. Maybe it's all the same size. Huh. It's been so long, I don't remember. Because, I've, like I said, I've been accumulating all of this for some time. So I can get it all together to show you guys. But that's going to be fun to play with. So there's that set. Okay. Moving on. And this is no particular order. Most of this I did get from Amazon. Some I got from TJ Maxx. Like this set here I got from TJ Maxx. And these are just graphite micro brush artist brush markers. Okay. And different colors. They were on a clearance. They were... $4.50 down from $7.99. So there's those. Okay. And then I needed some detail brushes. So I got these from um, Amazon. They're the Transcend brand. I've used a couple of these already and they are wonderful. I really, really like those. So, and you get a lot in here. And they are different sizes too. There's two missing out of here, the ones I've been using. So there's those. Okay, so the next I want to show, I got some more Rosa. This is the Rosa Studio. These are my favorite watercolors. They are wonderful. They are so pigmented and so, so pretty. I love this brand and the quality of these paints are so nice so so nice so there they are and then you have like the colors here also get a little booklet tells you more information about it but those are called Rosa and these are from Amazon okay and the next is I uh, got some more paintbrushes and these are by Artify and I had one by them, and I wanted the whole set. The one that I had was, oh, it's perfect for watercolor. 
So I seen that they had a set of these, so I went ahead and got um, a set. But they're also good for acrylics and oil and gouache. So that'll be nice. Um, but I don't like to use oil and watercolor and acrylic brushes. So if it's either or for me, so I will either use them for just watercolor and gouache, but I will not mix these with oil and then go back and use them with watercolor. I just don't, I, I wouldn't recommend that. Okay, so the next is I found these acrylic paints and they are pastel and oh my gosh, look how pretty these are. This is the Meaden brand. Never tried the Meaden brand, but I heard pretty good things about them. The reviews was really good. So there they are. Anxious to try those. So there's that. You get 12 in the set and the colors are here on the back. Um, and these also has all the transparency, pigment numbers, light fastness is also info is on these also for y'all okay next is been wanting these forever so I picked up this small box of the gouache and there they are these are from Holbein never had Holbein um, and they are pricey uh, but I wanted to try them out to see how good they are see what all the hoopla is about and see if I'm going to like them. So I'm going to give them a try. So if you see anything in the video that you want me to try out later in another video, let me know. Please comment down below and let me know that. Okay, um, here is Craft and Beyond Calligraphy Pens. These are black, small, medium, and large. I really can't remember Yes, these are an Amazon find. I had to think. A lot of the stuff I got off of Prime Day, there was a really, really good deal. So they just had here um, a few weeks back. So here's what they look like. Okay. Small, medium, and large. So there they are. And then what else? Okay. So um, Lindsay, the frugal crafter, showed these on her. Um, pay on her channel and I really like them. These are drawing pencils and they're really nice. I love how they are in different colors and of course they are different ranges um, in your pencil ranging from 4H, 3H, 2H, H, F, H, B. Then in the B's it goes from 2B all the way up to 8B. So, and I accidentally uh, bought two of these, and I'm going to be giving away the other when I reach uh, 2,000 subs. I am like eight away from 1,800, so I have like another 100 to go or so before I get to 2,000, but I will be giving these away when I hit the 2,000. Um, here's the set, the other set. <laughs> so, um... That'll be fun to do. I'll do something for the giveaway. Okay, and I got these little, um, these are handmade watercolors. Okay, and they come in this little tiny tin. And they are metallic and they are really, really cute. Really pretty. See the shine on them? So the, I have the other set of gold and I love those. So this is also another Amazon find. Okay. Um, let's see, what's next here in this box? Oh, I got um, a, the mini sketchbooks, but these are watercolor pages. Nice, nice, sturdy pages to do some miniatures in. But they came in a set of three, so that's how they came. Like this in the cello. So I'm anxious to try those and give them a whirl. Okay, what's next in here? Oh, I got another mechanical pencil set and this one here is just multi-colored. 
Um, this is HB 0 0.3, 0 0.5. Um, can't remember what the other one is. I'm not going to take them out. I have so many that are out now that but these are backups, and um, I just wanted to show you how pretty they were. So there's that. And then next is I got a set of Paul Rubens watercolors. I'm going to try these out. I'm probably do a video on these. Oh, look at the gorgeous colors. They are so nice. So they're the little tubes. They're the little five ounce, I believe. Yeah, five milliliter. So I'm going to try those out and see how they are. So there they are. Okay. And then it also has a, a swatch in there, like a, you know, your information guide. All right. And then, let's see here. There's another, um, I got some more ink. And this is the teal. I'll give it a little, that's the color of it. This is from Dollar and Rooney. Okay, let me put this box on the floor and then we'll go on to the next. So I got me a set of Posca color pencils. I love the Posca ink pens. They're the the paint pens and this is how the um, color pencils come. I watched a video and I, I don't remember the lady's name but it was an excellent excellent um, review and it had me sold on these. So you get 36 and they're all stacked and I just had to try them and they were on sale actually um, when I bought them. I think they're back up now but it comes with this nice little uh, elastic band to hold them together. Okay. Alright, moving on. I did get me some masking fluid. I like this one. The, um, it's the really, really precision line that you can make with uh, the masking fluid. So it has this really tiny, if you can see that. There it is. And it, you just squeeze it and it just goes through. And then when you put this back on, if I can get it there, it goes right back on that little tiny, another piece of wire thinner than that and it keeps it from getting clogged up. So there's that. Okay. Next is I found these. Um, these are ink pens. But what they are, are like a calligraphy pen. And then once they're empty, you just throw them away. So I originally got these for Inktober. And I was going to do the Inktober. And time got away. I got too busy. Didn't have time to do anything, you know, at all. I haven't... I've done other things um, for a, a painting cutting boards for a show that's, huh, uh, it took up all my time. So anyway, um, I got these to try out and if I like them, you know, I will continue to get those. Um, hopefully I can do the Inktober next year, but these are going to be fun to play around with. and. I can always use these in uh, journaling or just to, to draw with, but they're really cute and I, I love all the color choices that comes with those. Alright, now let's move on to the next, um, and here's, here's the, I was going to get this, I got this for Inktober. This is a sketchbook, um, this is 100 wood pulp, 110 GSM, 60 sheets paper is really really nice and it's an off-white color. I got that for the Inktober that I didn't get to do. <laughs> but I'll be ready. I uh, will be ready. So there's that. Okay and then I got this set of watercolor. Um, it's a new set 
I haven't I have not even opened it yet so you can see that it's brand new so let's take a look and this was off of Amazon this was on sale also um, when I found it and you have to really you got to look at this tin that this comes in so look at that oh my goodness actually that's the thing let me take this off and here's the tin oh my gosh how pretty is that so you get you know your little swatch card your information about let's see oh no that's not information that is a watercolor paper I'm sorry folks so yeah I haven't opened this up at all so um, but inside here everything fell out so this is what you get you get um, an eraser you get three brushes a pencil a water brush pen and you get a black acrylic marker and then your paints are here and there they are so I'm going to try these out see how they are and give them a whirl and see if I'm gonna like them I'm gonna leave that out and then on the bottom side it shows you actually because you get 50 colors 10 iridescent 4 neons 36 basic colors so, so there's that okay all right move it on to the next I think I'm missing something here. I'm looking and I don't see the main thing I wanted to show you guys. But let me move on. I'll do a separate video on it. Um, I went and I got me some Holbein watercolors. So I have not opened this one yet. So let's take a look at these. Never tried Holbein at all and I'm really really anxious to try these out and give them a whirl so there's the colors that's in this basic set it is the smaller tubes five milliliter okay and then you get a little information card and there they are okay let's move on like I said this is a big one um, I got this at uh, TJ Maxx and this is just it's not really art supply but it is something to keep art supplies in and it was just a little box that you can keep some stuff in and it was only um, $3.99 this is really cute okay moving on so my daughter gifted me this book set it is the workbook of the artist's way and the Artist Way book. It's the 30th anniversary edition and I'm anxious to do this step-by-step -step weekly um, I guess little weekly work and prompts and just to get started. It's a course in discovering your and recovering your creative self so I'm going to try this. I think it's going to be fun and then you know, of course there's the workbook you have you have all these tasks to do so I'm going to give these a whirl try it out okay the lady is uh, Ju Julia Cameron is the author all right okay, let me put those down all right next is I got this book called calming flowers it is a grayscale coloring book but I've got it not to color in, but to use as inspiration for when I do watercolors, and I think this is going to be perfect. Um, just to practice sketching the florals, and then I'm just going to paint them. I think this is going to be really nice. I just love the book. It's wonderful. Okay, so there's that. And then um, I got this other book, and I think this is the cutest little thing. This is called How to Draw Cute Little Woodland Animals. 
And these are so basic, so easy. But I thought they would be really, really cute to do on some wooden disc. And just the ideas that they have in here are really cute. I mean, these are just basic drawings. Um, but you get a lot of ideas. And then I got this free with this book. This is dot to dots, but lordy, I cannot see the numbers. Look, I cannot read that. It is so, so baby fine and so tiny. So I will not be using this. I think I'm going to put this in the giveaway when I reach the 2000. <laughs> so I'm going to have that with the pencils. So. There they are. That is just way too much. <laughs> um, I got this book here, uh, Your Creative Workspace. I got this from Ollie's. This was $3.99. And it just gives you ideas for your creative space and organizing and just different ways to design your room. Gives you ideas and nice pics to look at and inspiration. It's just a fun book. Okay, all right, moving on to the next. I picked up these uh, acrylic paint pens. Mine are drying out and I wanted a new set. And I got these from TJ Maxx. And they were on clearance too. I think they were um, down from 10, 10, 9.99 or 10 down to, I think, 6, 5.99. Um, I can't remember um, the price is I ripped it off for some reason. I was going to see what the original price was. Okay, now um, this here. This is a 72 it says 72 piece high tech LED LED lights. What this is, and it's not in the box, as I already have it um, on my desk. But it is a magnifier with light. So, um, oh my gosh, wonderful. If you are, have a hard time seeing detail, I really recommend one of these with the lights in it and you can see what you're missing. I don't know if I can reach this over to my camera. It is on an arm. Let me see. Oh, yes, I can. Look, see, this is what it looks like. And then, you know, of course you... Put your whatever you're working on underneath and it magnifies it and then it does have the light but I don't have this plugged in at the moment but anyway it hooks to the side of the desk and whenever I need it you know what I need to see I well hello Charlie let's get down bud I use it so um, I got that from Amazon and best little thing that I ever bought I I love this. All right. Um, next is I got these organizers at a thrift shop. They were three dollars each, and they are they're shelves. So it, it's like this. You can mount it on the wall if you want. And I bought four of these at three dollars each. What a buy! Uh, they were regular like five bucks wherever the store was um, brand new still in the cello so I got all that they had and they had four of them and I've got them all in use except for this one so I left this out so I could show you guys so um, the other thing I wanted to show you guys was the Maybelline watercolor that just came out um, and I don't know where it's at. I just realized I don't have it stacked. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, I do. Hold on, guys. I'm missing a whole other bag of stuff. Oh, for goodness sake. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Here we go. I got a five below bag full of stuff, but it's not five below stuff. It's different things. Oh, my goodness. I knew I had so much more stuff to show you guys. I thought, well, that don't seem like all of it. All right, let's keep on moving on. Um, I got this washi tape, and this is so pretty. You have to look at this. Oh, my. See all those beautiful washies? 
love that. Really, really pretty. I got this off of Amazon. I believe they were on sale when I found those also. Okay. Next is I got this Hemi solid watercolor. Love, 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 love this. Love this pretty, pretty color. I'm anxious to try this out to see how well they are because it really had excellent reviews on it and I'm thinking it's going to be really good just to play around with. So there's that. Okay. And next is I did get me a pack of these. This is just to play around with. These are like really, really cheap watercolors, I know. But I want something to practice and just to play with. So I got me those. Okay. All right. And then I told you this is a long, long video. All right. So I got me these brushes. And I've had my eye on these a while. And these are also from uh, Amazon. And these are watercolor brushes. They are from Oku. O-O-K-U. I guess that's how you say it. But these are going to be fun to work with. And they come in this cutest little um, holder. They have just different sizes. And, you know, there's a square, flat, uh, cat's tongue. The flat, yeah, the flat. And then you get a... Um, fan and a couple little round and a script. So there's that. Okay, moving on to the next. Let's see what else is in here. Oh, uh, this is just a pack of a watercolor paper and it's like five by seven. I'm gonna try that out. I love painting miniature, so this is gonna be perfect for that. Okay, and next is I got this journal and it's the prettiest journal very vintagey this is what it looks like so it has that wrap around it comes off okay and then it has the paper inside which is like a craft paper very smooth um, and then it has back here a place to put a few little things, like you got a card insert and a little thing here, a zip bag. So this is going to be fun to fill up, just um, just to draw in, and just to have fun in. I thought it was the prettiest little thing, and that's what it looks like. Okay. All right. Okay, down to the last couple things. My goodness, we're almost done. So here's the watercolor. The, the milling uh, solid watercolor. Okay, this has, let me get it out of the box, this has 52 colors, and I'll show you real quick. If you want me to do a separate uh, review on this, I'm just showing you real quick what's in this. There's your paints, okay, and then it comes with a, a marking pen, your pencil, a brush, a round brush has the, the edge that where you can do your um, markings and a sponge so I have to swatch these yet and um, I'm not sure if it did come with the swatch paper I know it came with a plastic thing here I have opened this up and looked at it already I'm not sure if it came with a swatch paper though but anyway um, this also comes in a pink but I picked the blue because I really like the blue. And there is also, if I can pull it out, you get some watercolor paper here. And pretty much anything you want to use it for. You want to make bookmarks or, you know, just some nice landscape uh, paintings will look nice on there. So there's that. Okay, and then the very last thing whew, is I picked up this large art creations sketchbook and got this from Amazon and I love the color. 
It looks more green on camera, but it is a teal, like a light tealy, minty green, I guess. More minty, I guess. But that's that is the last. 94 pound, 140 GSM, 80 sheets. Okay, guys. My goodness, this is a half hour long. This is crazy. So, thank you guys for watching. Super, super long video, but it was a lot of stuff. And uh, now I get to put it away, get to start using it. So, thank you guys for watching. Until next time, guys, I'll see you soon. Have a great day. Bye-bye.